Welcome, folks, to a new Let's Play, and or a new special feature, and possibly Let's Play. In this series, we're going to be taking a look at Iron Harvest 1920+. Plus. Alright, here we go. Listen to that music. One second, folks. I gotta turn down the, the volume here really quick. Alright, audio. The there we go. Okay. Anyway, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to our special feature and possibly let's play series of iron harvest um this is a kind not it's not an indie game but it's kind of a uh it's a game that didn't really get a lot of um publicity uh when it first came out a couple of years ago um essentially it's a it's a diesel punk uh version it's a diesel punk take on an alternate e version of 1920s uh the 1920s era um kind of a, under the assumption that the that world war one or what what we consider world war one never really ended um and is uh in under the assumption that rather than creating uh going with coal power and steam power we decided to go with oil power um and thus that helped um science branch off in a different direction and thus also managed to make it so that rather than having just regular tanks and planes and zeppelins we instead have oil powered battle mechs and mech suits and things of that nature as you can see on the screen um i am at least going to check out this this uh um this uh game for a little bit i'm not sure how it's going to go but uh I hope you guys enjoy it while it happens. Um, uh, I do also want to point out that uh, um, this is made by the same people who uh, made games like um, uh, oh, what's it called? Uh, Company of Heroes, and I think it's made by the same people who made Company of Heroes, um, or it's at least in the same style as Company of Heroes. Anyway. Um, Hope you guys enjoy, um, I'll leave the shilling to the end, but without any further ado, um, we are currently a private, uh, and we are gonna go ahead and go into the campaign. Let's go ahead and start the campaign. Um, okay, welcome commander, please select the experience you want the campaigns of iron harvest to offer you can change this setting for each mission in the campaign overview screen adventure and honor for players who want to balance between story and gameplay challenge or already have experience with real-time strategy games the, the default experience uh for players who exclusively want to enjoy the story and world of iron harvest or an un, or, are inexperienced with real-time strategy games Enemies have reduced strategic capabilities and your units have, are more experienced. You know what? I think we will go with uh, um, We will go with the discovery and exploration just for the sake of enjoying this the story um, I, One other thing I do want to point out is that this game Technically was made in uh, an Eastern European country. I'm not sure which one so uh, uh, It was developed I think in The Czech Republic, I think I might be wrong on that. I don't know um, but regardless, uh, they have ported it to be in English speaking, so you'll have to, you'll have to forgive the occasional somewhat jumpy and not matching up of the, the dialogue with stuff, so, um, we could go with native mode, I'm not going to, but if you ever want to, that's a thing. So here we go. Retreating. Press R and order units to retreat to your base. They will move faster and receive less damage while retreating. 
Okay. Look at that giant battle mech. <laughs> Jeez. Wait, what do you mean I can't join you? Guys can't throw or run fast! It will be unfair to the team you're on! Oh, that's not true! What are you going to do about it? Cry? Cry, baby! Let's go! I'm the Polanyans! That's so unfair! No, I'll show them! Gonna teach him a lesson. On my way. Cool. Cool. Fire away! Ow! Oh, hey! You're dead! Ambush! Take cover! Okay. Alright. Hey! She's not even playing! Fail! <laughs> One down, four to go. Funny. Funny. Piece of cake. Totally got you. Anybody can sneak up from behind. Over there? They've taken cover! On my way. Alright. Take this! Hey! Snow! Hit! Should take cover. Attack on it. Perfect spot. Fire away. Our hero is under attack. Maybe I can find a better position. Pre gotcha. I'm only wounded. All right. No. Nope. This way. The coward's attack! Over there? Let's come up here. Let's do a flanking maneuver. On my way. Gotta be quiet. Take this! Hey! Snow! Ah. No ice! The Polanyan fighter kills the next Rusviet! You're the Rusviet! The Rusviets are coming! Fall back! From now on, every hit counts! Hey, you were dead! You can <clears throat> run, but you can't hide! Alright. On my way. <coughs> okay. There's one! I should be safe there. Attack! There they are! Our hero is under attack! Alright. This will protect me. So I definitely like how they have... How they have... I should be safe ...incorporated there. a really nice story into this. Um, the coward's attack! Next time, just let me join in. It definitely feels an awful lot more like you're ah. like you're living in somebody's life rather than Getting just playing position. a series of missions. It's nice. I like it. On my way. All right. Get her! Attack! Bologna forever! Oh, hey! Ouch! You are dead! Someone your own size or taller. She's got reinforcements. Retreat. No shit. They cheated. I would have won. <laughs> it looked like they had you pretty much pinned down. Come on, let's go back to the village. Papa will be waiting. Or you could finally teach me to shoot. You did promise. 
I said when you're older. I am older than I was when you promised me. And how else will I defend myself in the war? When the war breaks out, you'll keep your head down. I'll take care of you. And what if you're not around? Uncle Lech says everybody in Polania must learn to defend themselves. I'll always be there for you. Well, the boys did have me pinned down back there, and if it hadn't been snowballs, but... Oh, Anna, all right, but... Uh... I know, I know. Don't tell Papa. I'm going to regret this. Yes, yes, you are. All right, there are deer in this forest. Let's be very quiet and try to find some. Uh-huh. All right, then. Take the lead, General. General. New primary objective received. Yeah? Over there? Gotta be quiet. So, you're abandoning your men just like that? I'm waiting for your orders, General. Sorry! I guess you have to take them both with you this, this time. Way. Over there? Over there! I see it! Where? I don't see anything. Piece of cake. Gotta be quiet. All right. Piece of cake. Notice how they always say piece of cake Over and there? not piece of pie. I much prefer pie to cake, if I'm being totally honest. On my way. It's got better texture. It tastes better. It's usually more del more delectable than eating Over cake. There? Don't get me wrong. There are some cakes out there that are pretty decent, but yeah, I don't know. Piece of cake. Here goes. Quiet. Deer are prey animals, so they are very attentive. We need a new strategy, General. Mm. I'll hide in some bushes so they can't see me, and you'll drive them in my direction. Good plan. Just make sure you shoot the deer and not me. Quiet now. I'm ready. Drive the deer to me. Very well. Let's find some deer. Fine. Good plan. On my way. I walk in the park. Shuffling. Sure Fine. I walk in the Let's park. Let's see what we got here. Let's see. Good plan. I walk in the park. <sighs> I hate hunting. It's so annoying. On my way. There it is. Let's get it into shooting range. Shuffling. I'm ready. Hold still. Got him. No, I didn't get him. Ugh, drat! Good hiding spot. But that was a terrible shot. I think something's wrong with this rifle. Look, when you pull the trigger, you can't wonder if you're going to hit. You already have to know. 
You see the target? You see how it moves? You feel when the time is right, and then... POW! Venison for dinner. I understand. I think. Alright. Piercing shots. Alright. You hide in the bush, and I... I know! Quiet like a mouse. Hmm? I walk in the park. Sure thing. On my way. Let's see here. Sure thing. On my way. Sure thing. I walk in the park. On my way. Good plan. I walk in the park. Okay, here we go. On my way. I walk in the park. Sure thing. I walk in the park. On my way. Sure thing. Good plan. There he is. Sure thing. Yeah. I'm going to hit. I know it. Got him. I... I hit it! Clean shot, Butterfly. Papa will never believe me. He won't know anything about it. I shot the deer, remember? Oh, right. And what a shot it was. Your best so far. <laughs> Joker. <laughs> Ugh, really cool. this is disgusting. That's part of it. We don't kill for fun. Well, that's Yannick, nice. do you do you really think there will be war? Sure. And this time it's going to be a big one. Saxony, Roosevelt, the Nordic Kingdoms, maybe even the Shogunate. The whole wide world. Will the soldiers come here too? To this dump? Why would they? <laughs> Yannick! Shoot! Shoot! Suits. Whew. That was pretty close. Yes. Thank you. Must have been hungry. Hey, Arthur! Take the beast! It will make a warm coat for Siberia. You're going to war? To Rosviet? Aye. Defending the motherland against Rosviet aggression. Wow. Pretty impressive, huh? Shmiawi. Latest model. They won't even know what hit them. So awesome! Come on, the village can't be far. Y you're looking for Zaleshe. I'm from there, I can take you there. Well, then hop on up, soldier. Head straight back, all right? And don't forget the roast! All right. Hello. Head straight back, go. all right? And don't forget the roast. Ugh. Hello?
Ah, the bar. Hello, bar. But it's not your decision, Bjorn. It's the boy's decision. If he wants to defend his motherland, it will be a bloodbath. You know what those machines are capable of. Every volunteer receives the best training and equipment. And who knows, maybe one day you will command one of these. He will not. I won't let my son die in another meaningless war. Meaningless? We are defending our homes, our freedom. What do you want your son to become? A patriot or a coward? Like me? We will all do our part to protect Polania. Will you? I don't think the war will be that bad. And Uncle Lech will look after me. Everyone will be home by Christmas, boy. This is not a game, Yannick. It's... It's the right decision. You are a man and a Polanyan. You should be proud to be both. I Yon. guess it's just made in Poland. <laughs> Yannick! You're going to war? You heard him. Just for a few months. You're leaving me alone! No! Never. I... Just want to protect you. The war is coming, whether we want it or not. Uncle Lech says the best chance we have is to strike fast and hard. We have to show the Roosevelt's and Saxonians that we won't put up with anything. We won't hide. But Papa says it's going to be a bloodbath. Papa is not a fighter. He would rather hide out here until the end of time and repair rusted farm equipment. He doesn't understand. Then. Then I want to go with you. I'm doing this for you, Butterfly. Don't go. It's only for a few months. Sure, that's what they always say. Oh, precious little bar. The war would be an adventure. Promising pride and honor. In the end, it would be five years. Years of torment and horror, like the world had never seen before. For the first time, the great nations of the world faced each other with weapons that could kill dozens, hundreds, with a single blow. The war is over now, but it cost the lives of millions. Among them, Yannick, my brother, who wanted to be back for Christmas, who had promised never to leave me. Very cool. Alright, ladies and gentlemen. Um, that's going to about do it for today's initial episode. Um, God, I love that music. Um, I think I'm going to try and make this at least a little bit of a, of a series. Um, we'll see how things go. But I'm initially, by the time you guys are seeing this, I'm going to be putting up a... This is a test... Uh, kind of a test to see if you guys will enjoy it. If you do, um, please be sure to subscribe to the channel and also be sure to leave a like and a comment telling me uh, what kind of... Um, I guess what, what you like most about what we've seen so far of this game. It's It's gotten really great reviews on Steam um, and uh, it seems like it's going to be a fun game to play. Um, I just don't know how long it is, and, uh, it might take a while, so. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for joining me. I'm Michael Shockman, I've been your host and commentator, and until next time, guys, remember as always, keep it real, keep it safe, keep it healthy, and we'll see you guys in the next one. Peace off, everybody.